Hey guys, the Black Stealth here, and I'm gonna show you how to fix the black screen in Minecraft. So first thing you gotta do is you gotta make sure your mod is compatible for the current version of Minecraft. If it's not, then that's probably your problem. But then the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna delete the Maven Imp. Now, if you know you've already done this, um, you can just skip this step and go to the next step. Um, but if you're not sure or whatever, then just do it. So go to your name and then library, or go to go. If you don't see a library folder right there, go to go and then hold down the alt option key and go to library. Then once you're in library, go to application support, then scroll down to the Minecraft folder, Minecraft, and then bin. Uh, you've probably already done this since you installed the mod. But now you have Minecraft.jar. So what you can do is you're gonna rename this to Minecraft.zip and then you're gonna double click on it. Won't look quite the same since I haven't been archive it. Um but it'll be the, it'll do the same things. So rename the folder you just made to Minecraft.jar. You'll get a little pop up, just say use jar. In Minecraft.jar, um, go to the meta int folder, <clears throat> and then go into here. Now delete these two ma Mojang fi files. Uh, yeah, don't delete the entire folder because sometimes that screws stuff up. You only need to delete the two Mojang files on a Mac. So once you've done that, you can try Minecraft, and if it still doesn't work, we're on to step two. So in step two, uh, just go to where your Minecraft is, go to Minecraft, application, right click on it, that's just a control click, or on trackpads, two fingers, and then click, and then hit show package contents. In here, double click on your contents, and then info.plist. Uh, I don't want to, uh, right click on it, I'll just open it with dash code. <clears throat> if you don't have dash code, open it with text edit. And scroll down almost all the way to the bottom where it says string 1.6 plus and then string. If this says 1.5, then change it to 1.6. Once you've done that, if it says 1.6, you're good. Once you've done that, um, open up a new finder window. So go to file, new finder window. And in here, uh, go to Macintosh HD. Uh, if you don't see the Macintosh HD right there, it's easy to show, just go up to Finder, and then Preferences, and then click on Sidebar up here, and then check this hard disks box right there. And then see, let to check it, it shows up. So uh, once you're on Macintosh HD, go to System, Library, and then go to Frameworks. Once you're in here, just search for Java, and then look for Java VM Framework, right here. You will you will have this. If you've ever tried to open up Minecraft before, and you've been able to do it and play, uh, you will have this file. So uh, once you're in here, go to Resources, and then go to Mac OS, uh, just Mac OS. Right here you see a Java application stub. Now you're just going to copy this, so hover over uh, Mac OS, so just drag it, hover over it, this, and then just hit Replace. It'll automatically copy it for you, and so yeah. And then you still have one more thing to do <clears throat> before you can attempt to open up Minecraft. So the next thing we got to do is just search for Java Preferences. And in here you should see 64-bit and 32-bit. If the 64-bit isn't at the top, make sure you, you click on it, you hold it, and you drag it all the way to the top. Once this is up there, make sure 64-bit uh, is highlighted, hit Options, and then you're going to paste this in. Uh, this is gonna like give Minecraft one gig of RAM, and um yeah, <clears throat> and then you can do it with 32 bit as well. So just do that, and once you've done that, you're actually not quite ready. We still need to go back into the contents and open up this info.plist, and right here where it says SM. XMS, it won't say this for you. Um, where it says XMS, it will say like 512 or something. Just change that to 1024. And then right here where it says 204, or where, what, um, it'll probably say 10 something. Just change that to 1024 as well. Uh, you can change it to 2 like I had it. I'll just change it back. Uh, well, once it's like that, 
then you can try opening up Minecraft. Ah. Now you can try opening up Minecraft. And yeah, it works. So, yeah. Uh, now one last thing, if you still have a black screen fix, uh, you installed the mod one. Or there's two mods conflicting, two files conflicting from two different mods that you installed. Or there's something going on with the mod. But for now it's not your computer, and it's the mod. So, yeah. Thanks for watching Black Screen Fix so 2.0.